No, 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 no. Mick Inkman was born on December 15th, 1952 in Rumford, England, and belonged to a very adorable couple family. Mick's parents loved him very much because they were great. Mick was not excited to go to school time. His parents got divorced and the family moved to New York City. Mick was all alone. So he watched a TV show that would heavily inspire his life called Monty Python's Flying Circus. And that would heavily inspire him to always draw whenever he can. In 1975, he made his first animated short called What For, featuring Roger the Black Cat with a scarf. Mick said, quote, A book is something that I could think of anything. It's a common misconception. A month later, in 1971, he met with Nick Butterworth. Nick Butterworth had extra legs. And later in 1981, he made his first character to become a star. He made a lot of Kipper books that were made. And in 1991, they launched Grand Slam Children's Films. That featured Percy the Parky for starring Jim Broadbent. And the rescue party, the rescue party one snowy night after the storm in the secret path. Mick was already on as a series creator and producer, along with television star and producer Paul Karlacki, writing the show's treatment. It was announced that the new series, Kipper, was granted $4.2 million for 13 episodes and 6 seasons. Nick Jr. Put up, put, Nick Jr. puts up new kids' TV shows, 8.4 invested British kids' shows, that would heavily do that as well. Kipper will be produced in France in Teletoon. Martin Clunes will voice Kipper. And Mick Inkpen's design looks very well. He explained that the Kipper's book was inspired by his pet dog. Budapest Animation Studio Varga Holdings was hired to animate the show. The show's thesis was, quote, with Sandor and the Crazy Yellow Fox for singing in uptight readiness, Kipper will be for adorable readiness. Kipper belongs to Nick Jr., and all the children loved it. Kipper has six seasons and 13 episodes in each season. And on September 5th, 1997, nearly four years after receiving its initial funding, Kipper premiered on Nickelodeon. A Dog with an Imagination is coming to public television, and it was a big hit, and it really inspired me.